going on guys? Today I have a review for you of the Super Lego Pro. This was a iPhone 4 slash 4S case sponsored by A Case. Go ahead and check out their website in the description right below. Click that. As well as an actual link to this product. This as at the recording of this video is selling for $13.95 on Amazon. And so this video is just gonna be sort of a review of what I like about it, what I don't like about it, and I, in the end, we'll see if it justifies the cost. So with that said, let's go ahead and get started. All right, so first things first, let's just show you guys around the case. So uh, upon first glance, it just appears like a, you know, a normal iPhone case, but you'll see in a second that it has something that I really haven't seen before. So um, just, you know, the basic, basics real quick going around it. Uh, we do have, you know, a little cutout for the power. We have a little plug here, um, I guess like a little cover for the headphone jack so you don't get a lot of dust or anything in there. Coming over here, you have your um, power up and down buttons as well as a cutout for your vibrates uh, silent switch. Down below, you have two holes, one for the speaker, one for the microphone. Similar flap as the headphones for your 30-pin connector. And the back is solid with the camera cutout. But uh, what's definitely unique about this case is that it's two layers, which I found very interesting. The back layer here is just plastic does a good job, um, covers all the corners, covers pretty much the entire edge except just this little cutout here and um, for your headphones and stuff obviously whereas this part is just silicone as you can see it's kind of like sort of like a um, Wiimote sort of feel like almost maybe like a wetsuit or something silicone but um, it's, it feels very nice so let's go ahead and um, on my iPhone I currently have a clear case on so I'll go ahead and take that off very quickly Alright, so that's coming off. So I'm going to go ahead and just put this right in the silicone case. Works like you would think. Alright, there you go. Now, I will point out that if you really wanted to, you could probably just use this as your case. You really don't need this. However, I will say I wouldn't recommend it because it does, um, as you can see, it's not a very, very snug fit. I mean, obviously, this isn't just what the case was meant to be. It's supposed to go in here. But uh, you could use this if you don't want uh, to add a more bulk to your phone. And I'll get more into that later. But um, you could use this, but however, I just wouldn't recommend it. So let's go ahead and finish the job here. So see the little cutout? And it simply fits nice and snug right inside there. And as you can see, since this outside is now plastic, uh, you don't have that um, fanning out as much. All you see there is silicone, but the plastic remains nice and sturdy. So this gives the phone a very nice and sturdy feel to it. The, um, everything lines up perfectly. You can see the silent switch is there. Um, there's a little cutout for the headphone jack, power. It all works uh, very nicely. Everything lines up very nice. You can see the speaker grills are perfect. So um, pretty much just the only cons of this case, really, it covers the beauty of the phone, which is why I have, you know, this case. This case, you're not paying for luxury, you're paying for something that will protect your phone. And this definitely does a great job of that. I mean, I'm not going to drop my iPhone, you know, just on purpose to test the case unless I uh, had like a sponsored iPhone or something, but I mean, that right there is not affecting the phone at all. I mean, what's not being absorbed by this little plastic piece, like when it falls, is will be absorbed by the silicone. So, I mean, your edges won't get scratched if you drop this phone. And also, um, these sit not quite flush with the screen. So if you drop it, um, the case will hit before the actual screen will. So, I mean, I'm not saying you could drop your phone. It's going to be invincible. That's not the case with any case, no pun intended. But um, this will definitely help uh, against drops. But like I said, really the only downfall of this case is that um, it covers the beauty of the phone, which I can't even really say is a con. Because like I said, you're not paying for luxury. You're not paying for, you know, like a leather case or one that's um, transparent. You're paying for protection. And in the eyes of many, protection is much more valuable than to be able to see the back of the phone. However, if you're like me, I really like to see the iPhone's design. Um, half, I won't say half, but I mean, at least some decent portion of the reason I have an iPhone is because of the way it looks. I mean, it functions absolutely great. That's obviously the main reason I have the phone. But I like to see, you know, and feel the real thinness and the real, I just like to see the actual phone and feel the actual phone in my hand, not with a case around it. So that's just my personal take on it. But overall, this is definitely a great case. It provides um, a very decent amount of protection. Um, like I said, I mean, you could drop this. That's really not um, affecting the phone at all. All this, the shock is being absorbed into the silicone and or plastic. And so one thing that I will say that um, I praise is that uh, this camera hole. Some cases you get and they cut it pretty close, especially around the flash. 
and what that does is it blocks the flash from giving the full effect and you get sort of like a white over your pictures absolutely not the case here um, I could take pictures on this thing in fact my last video you can, you can watch that by clicking the annotation that was shot uh, like the outdoor test was shot with this case on it and you couldn't tell um, in low light situations where I'm using flash this doesn't affect it at all so this is definitely a great case so um, for $1,395 you're paying for a case that really will help protect your two to three or four hundred dollar cell phone so um, I, I, if I were to give this a rating out of five stars I'd definitely give it four and a half to five um, definitely worth you know the thirteen ninety five. There's some cases that cost more than this that are less appealing and also less effective. Now, while this case is just straight black, it does give the phone a nice look. I mean, it's just um, white and then just like a black edge, a nice smooth edge. You know, it, I just like this case a lot. Um, I'll be I'll I'll use this if I'm just walking around school or something. But you know, maybe if it's raining outside or if I'm going to be somewhere where you know if it falls, it could be a bigger risk. Then this is the case to have. So. Different cases, different price points. This is like $4 on eBay, but also different purposes. So with that said, like I said, I definitely give this case at least a 4.5 out of 5, make it a 9 out of 10. Um, and it really just depends on your personality. I mean, if you really don't care that much about the look of the phone and you don't want this, then I, I see absolutely no reason to not get this case. I mean, it's just a simple yet very effective case and feels great in the hands at the same time. So once again, thank you to A-Case. Check out their links below. Um, very nice of them to sponsor this, so if you have any more questions about this case or anything, I'm at CPU Kid on Twitter. Feel free to leave a comment on this video, and like I said, check out A Case website down there. So before I ramble anymore, thanks for watching.